What's going on YouTube? My name is Ron King back again with one more video. As always, if you enjoy the content, please leave a like on the video. Leave comments as well. Leave feedback with those comments and subscribe to the channel for related business content. Now, welcome to today's edition of the Home Bar Beauty Shopify update series. So we'll go ahead and get right into it. This week, we had only $51.90 in sales. So not as much as I would have liked, definitely not, um, but it's better than nothing. Um, let me look at the traffic here. It's been a lot more traffic than before just because those Google ads that I was talking about last week, they went live this week. And so we're getting a lot more traffic, as you can see, a 37% increase in traffic. Um, and I've noticed that a lot of people are looking at this product specifically right here. The Butler Vincent um, Antique Cherry Multi Game Table. And so what I did was for this product, I've just been adding and adding to the prescription to, to the description of the product. Just making sure that when the buyer comes to this page, they see a lot of information, including the dimensions, whatever it's good for, all the information assemblies required and different things of that nature so that they can make an informed buying decision. For whatever reason, no one has pressed the button and actually bought that product yet, but I am hoping that soon somebody will actually buy the product because there's been a lot of views on that page. As you can see here, let me go over here. It's been like the most viewed product on the store. As you can see, 95 views within what the last two weeks, 14 days. So I will continue to add to the description, just try to find out why people aren't converting on that product and we'll just keep it going from there. So this is my Google ads account, the new one that the company logical position set up for me. Um, as you can see, these are my clicks and impressions, 641 clicks, 121 impressions, man, I, I would like my conversion rate to be a lot higher because you know, I haven't got anything even remotely close to 641 sales. I'd like to have at least, you know, a 3.5 to 5% conversion rate on that. Um, I'm sure if I look at my Google Analytics, my conversion rate is pretty bad right now. But we're actively taking steps to increase that conversion rate by adding more information to the product pages and just making sure that everything is secure within my brand so that people come to my site and they trust that this is a legit site and that they will get their product on time and um, they will be satisfied with it. So, all right, uh, I'm not gonna go through all of these, but I wanted to show you guys the different, some of the different uh, products, the different campaigns for these products. So. All right, so this is my campaign for the items between $100 and $500 um, that aren't bar stools, basically. It's miscellaneous. Um, spent about $35 on it, and looks like the most, the most uh, viewed product is the Madison, uh, I'm not sure how to say that word, the Madison bar set. Let me show you guys that product. Yes, sir. So it's this product right here. If I'm not mistaken, this product is actually out of stock right now. Yes, it's out of stock right now. The supplier has not restocked the product. Um, and so I am not able to sell it. It sucks to have to advertise a product that's out of stock because I'm really just burning money at that point. But it is what it is. We keep going. You know, um, I'm not going to let any of those things detract or get me away from what I'm trying to do. So this is the campaign that I actually converted. Um, you'll see that this is the product for the miscellaneous products under $100. Let me go up here and I should be able to see it. Go down here. Right, miscellaneous under $100. Um, so we'll go, right, this is the product that actually converted. So this product cost me 576 
and I made two sales off of it. So I'm happy with that. I, I really am just because I, I, I only spent $5 to make the sale basically. Um, and I was able to convert on two of those products. If that could be the case for all my products, I'd be very happy. But let's move on from Google Ads. I think I've showed you guys enough there. So we actually have a new supplier. The name of the supplier is Baxton Studio. Uh, you can see some of their products here. Um, so we will be listing a lot of their bar furniture on the site here. Um, as you can see, they have a lot of table and chair sets, chairs and stools. So we'll be listing a lot of these, probably not all of them because it's just so many, so much stuff, but they have some very high quality products and I researched their store and basically they get a, a good amount of traffic. So I'm happy to have them on board with us. So as time goes on, we're going to set up some campaigns for Baxton Studio as well so that we can get some traffic for them and hopefully convert and get more sales. So. That's about all I want to show you guys for this week. Again, not a lot of sales, but we are slowly but steady, steadily doing better and better. And we are going to continue to improve so that we can get these conversions and grow the business. So as always, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe to the channel for business related content. My name is Ron King. Have a great day. Peace.